We're in downtown Toronto, Canada, center of the universe. Bombay. Chow so we're going Pati. to do another restaurant food review. Restaurant food review at Lahore Indian Tika House. Okay? And it's like really snowing, um, which is where maybe in the summertime it's open. Or the restaurant. Here's the restaurant. Please enter through parking lot. All right, we're going in. It's Monte Crew Review. Yeah. And we're doing another restaurant review. Let's go in. <laughs> Here we're going. Hey, John Petucci, so he actually was in here? So is that guy, that's that chef guy. It smells so good. What does it smell like? It smells so good in here. Oh my God, yeah. and right now. And you can see the tables all have nice fabric on them. What's that? Ooh. Wow. Ah. order on the board and then place it on the counter. Order and pay. Number one. Just write your order on the whiteboard. Okay. Write your order here. Number two, take it to the counter. Oh, you will receive a number. Please make the number visible. The, no, this is the lamb shank. Lamb shank. These are the samosas. This is the naan, nice and fluffy. And this is the egg uh, cauliflower. Yeah. Oh, this is a curry goat lamb. Uh -huh. uh, what's that one there? Um, that's beef nihari. Yeah, this one's vegetarian. Okay, beef nihari. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Ooh. How does it taste? <laughs> Pour some in mine. It's good. Is it way better than the ones you make at home? Ten times. Ten times, right? Try it. Penny Pure here, go. With yogurt on the top this time. Yeah, the water's cold. That's what they said they do chill. I didn't know that, but it tastes good like that. And the, like um, the coriander makes it taste more fresh. That's excellent. And the onion. And the onion is good. Thumbs up. This place is awesome. They're putting the lemon on your samosa? Lucas is using a fork and knife. Try it. These are nice and crispy. These are like deep fried. What? It's vegetable. Good? Mmm. Hot. It's stunning. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. So that's all the waiters here in Miami. Thank you. Yeah, this chicken tikka. All right. Thank you. It's still boiling. I love these little tiny cast iron things with the wood. It's very pretty. It's still bubbling. It's still bubbling. That's the chicken tikka. Look at the bubbles in there. Look at that rice. Steaming. Aspen, how's that samosa? Yum. Oh! <laughs> and these are beef kebabs. Beef kebabs, yeah. Thank you. Whoa! Oh, 
cooking. That's nice. Still cooking. So what would you rate this restaurant compared to the one, the Joe's Buffet one we went downtown? I like it's uh, more like a real experience. So here's mom's plate. This is the beef kebab. She's going to use her hand to eat like traditionally. But I'm holding the camera with my right hand, so I'm having to eat with my left. <laughs> Very good. I like the cauliflower. It's kind of sweet. It's got like cinnamon in it or something. Yeah, it said online that um, it's going to take really long for the food to come, but it came really fast. Like, yeah, so fast. For Sunday, it came really fast. We were impressed. Very good, yes. Do you know Ah, sure. Yeah, we're good. I guess so. It doesn't matter, guys. Okay. Two. <laughs> Hunter ate something spicy. <laughs> Rose water. Wow. This is called Faluda. So you have ice cream. Mm. Thank you. Vermicelli noodles, I think. You know, vermicelli noodles. What is that? I don't know. What is this? What does it taste like? It has like strings. Those are the noodles. It tastes the popsicles. It tastes like the popsicles, right? Get to check it out. It's on Gerard Street in Toronto. We will have we will have the link in the description below of how to get here and enjoy yourself too. Yeah. Bye, people. Thanks for watching. We'll see you Bye. again.